Hello everyone and welcome back. I was out cutting wood today for the wood boiler and I finally broke my chainsaw. I've had this thing for over 25 years and I, a log came up. I mean it's smashed. This falls off sometimes. I gotta put it back on. But there was plastic right here. Anyway a log came up and came down and this is the thing that like when you want to shut it off you go all the way up you go all, you pull the trigger, you go all the way down, that chokes it, and when it starts you go halfway, let it run, and then, you know, you're good to go. Anyway, it broke today, so I'm going to have to figure that out. Looks like something might have got bent in here too. I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, the reason why I'm posting this video is, you know, we've got uh, Northern Seclusion, almost 100,000 subscribers, Jones X Survival, it's got to be pushing 250,000. But... I have a community Facebook page, Jones X Survival Northern Seclusion, where I post other stuff, just pictures. I post there all the time. That's where I put bloopers with profanity alert, you know, non-family friendly stuff that I don't put on the channel. Anyway, I, uh, I, I don't know how many years I've had that now. It's up to, you know, of all the subscribers, there's between 10 and 11,000 people that follow the community Facebook. Well, and I enjoy that because I post stuff there constantly. Like when I was up to the tent, if you saw the tent video, you would have saw pictures of me crossing the lake, getting to the tent before anybody walked up to the tent, you know. So, anyway, in the last three years, I always have trouble because when I started that channel, or the Facebook page, you know, I did it as a, um, like a business page or whatever. Anyway... As their guidelines changed, it has to be linked to your personal name. And mine wasn't. I don't want my personal Facebook and my, you know, I don't want everything together. So I kept it separate. And anyway, every year now for the last two years, there'll be a time when I can't access it. And then I would go through some stuff and get it accessed. Well, anyway, this time it happened again right after, it happened on January 23rd. And I can't access it. And there's no way for me to go from that page and add my own page to it. What it is, is it, the guideline that it, that it um, doesn't follow is I'm under a fake name or something like that. So anyway, it's the stupidest thing ever, to be honest. But it, regardless, I'm sick of it. So that page is going to go away in probably another 20 days. I don't know, 30 days after the 23rd. And what I did was I just started the one the correct way. So now there's probably 10 people that <laughs> have clicked on it. So I thought I'm going to put this video up, put it on. I'll explain more of it in the video because I already explained it in the video I'm doing for Northern Seclusion right now. My next Jones Act Survival video, I'll explain it there also in more detail. But um, anyway, if, if you are a follower of that or you want to follow that, uh, please go there. The link is in the description. Click on it, whatever you got to do, and go over there and like that page so I can get some people back. I posted something the other day, and like a day later, nobody had seen it. So it's so weird for me because usually I post something, and my phone will just be going, you know, a little thingy will just go constantly, and there'll be six, eight hundred, six or 800 people that have seen it within, you know, 10 minutes. So anyway, that's the only reason I'm posting this, trying to keep it short so that I can upload it with the house internet tonight. I'll put it up on both channels so you guys can see it. And if you're into, if you were already there, please click on that link. The other one is not going to be used anymore. And uh, if you're not a subscriber to it, go on there because a lot of good stuff gets posted on there. I wish you guys could go back over the last five or six or however many years I've had it to see all of the stuff. I might go in there and try to download the bloopers and and put them again up on this one here. But anyway. And almost every daily, you know, I'll post something. So please go over there uh, and, you know, check it out so you can see what's going on. Don't know if you can see it, but this is the piece that broke right here. I don't even know how that hooked up. Maybe it like this? I don't know. I'll see you guys on the next video. Luckily, I got quite a bit of wood cut before I broke the chainsaw because 
uh, I think tomorrow morning or the following morning, anyway, we're going to have temperatures, actual air temperatures, close to 30 degrees below zero Fahrenheit with wind chills in that 50 to 60 below range.